Libra, you need to know this right now for July the 19th through July the 20th, 2024. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see for the star sign of Libra for July the 19th through July the 20th, 2024. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see for the star sign of Libra for July the 19th through July the 20th, 2024. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see for the star sign of Libra for July the 19th through July the 20th, 2024. Show me. You guys, subscribe, like, comment, and share these videos. If this does not resonate with you, check your moon, rising, and Venus sign videos. I do not read reversals. Libra, you need to repent and get your life together. If you're interested in a private reading, you can reach me at herimmortalmajesty at gmail.com. Libra, these are your cards, honey. <clears throat> so, Libra, you have the hangman. Could be dealing with a Pisces, but the hangman signifies that the relationship is stagnant right now. It's suspended in the air. There's no movement, but you may be beginning to change your perspective. So Libra, could be dealing with a Pisces, but you're telling me that you guys are stagnant. Something is hanging in the balance. However, you could be changing your perspective. Clarify the hangman for Libra. Clarify the hangman for Libra. Clarify the hangman for Libra. It is clarified with the high priestess. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is she who knows. She who knows. This is the keeper of the hidden secrets. Keeper of the hidden knowledge. The universe is calling for you to use your intuition. But you may know something that you're keeping to yourself. Now the high priestess keeps silent. So it's a good chance that you guys aren't speaking to one another. So Libra, you can tell me that you guys aren't speaking. You can tell me that you're using your intuition. Or you have a secret. Clarify the high priestess. For Libra, clarify the high priestess. For Libra, clarify the high priestess. For Libra, it is clarified with the two of cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is, we see eye to eye, face to face. We are spiritually connected. We are one. We are meant to be. We are soulmates. Soulmates with a divine union, a divine connection. So Libra, very well could be dealing with your soulmate here, but this can also be in an agreement. Now Libra, listen, you can tell me that you're stagnant and you're not speaking to your soulmate. Libra, you could also tell me that you're using your intuition concerning some type of an agreement. It's just hanging in the balance right now. Maybe waiting for you to make a decision. Libra, you have the three of wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This is you waiting, waiting for your ships to come in, waiting for what you set your intentions towards to manifest. Now, this is also a card of you looking to see what else is out there, looking to expand. So, Libra, listen, you can tell me that you're waiting. You can tell me that your ships are here. You can tell me that you're looking to see what else is out there, looking to expand or even travel. Clarify the three of wands. For Libra, clarify the three of wands. For Libra, clarify the three of wands. For Libra, it is clarified with the hermit. Could be dealing with a Virgo, but right now you're taking some time out to be alone to do some soul searching, introspection, searching your inner man for wisdom and guidance, going within, looking for answers. Could be dealing with a Virgo, but you can tell me that, hey, I just need some me time. You can tell me that you're doing some heavy duty soul searching or you went on a solo search looking for something. Clarify the hermit. For Libra, clarify the hermit. For Libra, clarify the hermit. For Libra, it is clarified with the nine of swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. 
This is you being anxious, worried, stressed, replaying things over and over in your mind, losing sleep at night, worried about something. So Libra, you're all up in your head, stressed, worried, anxious, can't eat, can't sleep, bothered by something here. Now Libra, listen, you can tell me that you're in your head about this agreement, you're using your intuition and doing some soul searching concerning this agreement. Libra, you can tell me that you're in your head and you're thinking that maybe you need to look to see what else is out there because you and your soulmate are stagnant. Or you're telling me that you're in your head and just doing some soul searching left waiting and hanging here concerning your soulmate. You guys aren't speaking. Libra, you have the lovers. Could be dealing with a Gemini. But the lover says, you know, I breathe you in, you breathe me in. We are so magnetically attracted to one another. We cannot get enough of one another. Babe, I need to make a choice. So Libra, could be dealing with a Gemini. But you can tell me that you guys have the strong twin flame magnetic pull. You can tell me there's another other lover. But the lovers could also be a partnership with work or business. Who are the lovers? For Libra, clarify the lovers. For Libra, clarify the lovers. For Libra, it is clarified with the Eight of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is mastering your craft, perfecting your skills, trades, and abilities. This is you throwing yourself into your work. But this can also speak to you being willing to work on it or put in the work. So Libra, listen, this could all be work or business. You can tell me that you're willing to work on it, willing to put in the work. You can tell me that you're working on something, planning something, perfecting something here. Now, Libra, this could all be work or business, dealing with a partnership with work or business here. Could be some type of an agreement. Maybe you're waiting and thinking or you were expecting something here. Libra, you could also tell me that there was another other lover involved in the picture and maybe we're going to work things out. You guys are stagnant. You know this is your soulmate, but maybe you're going to work things out. Libra, you could also tell me that someone had another other lover at work. You or them. Libra, you have the Eight of Wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This can indicate that things are happening quickly. This can speak to travel. But this is the fast, rapid moving energy of communicating back and forth over the airwaves, the internet, with text messages, messenger, WhatsApp, emails, phone calls, even face to face communication. But this is also the fast, rapid moving energy of being intimate. So Libra, you can tell me that something is happening quickly here. This could involve travel. You guys could have gotten into a heated discussion or argument, throwing fiery dots at one another. Or someone was communicating passionately online with someone else or being intimate with someone else. Clarify the eight of wands. For Libra, clarify the eight of wands. For Libra, clarify the eight of wands. For Libra... It is clarified with the Nine of Wands, Aries, Leo, or Sag. This is you being guarded and standing your ground. You have a stance. You meant what you said. You said what you meant. You're not willing to bend, concede, meet halfway, out of out, or anything. But this is also a card of you saying, you know what? I'm tired. I'm wounded. I'm down for the count. But I still have a little fight in me left. I'm not giving up. Being persistent. But this is also a card of you having your walls up, your guards up. You're not trusting. A little suspicious, a little paranoid. So Libra, listen, you can tell me that you're highly suspicious. You have your guard up, you don't trust. You can tell me that you're guarding something. You can tell me that you're going to be persistent or you're standing your ground. Now Libra, listen, when it comes to work or business, you can tell me that you guys had a heated discussion or argument and you're standing your ground. You can tell me that you're thinking about leaving and you're standing your ground here. Libra, you can tell me that you and your partner in this relationship had a heated discussion or argument. Mm -hmm. And maybe you're standing your ground. Or you're telling me that you're highly suspicious you have your guard up, that they were communicating passionately online with someone else or being intimate with someone else. Or you could have been trying to guard the fact that you were. Libra, you have the Nine of Cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is wish fulfillment. But this can also speak to you feeling smug or overindulging in alcohol or substance abuse. So Libra, listen, you can tell me that you're getting your wish. Could be feeling smug here or overindulging, trying to numb out. Clarify the Nine of Cups. For Libra, clarify the Nine of Cups. 
for Libra. Clarify the Nine of Cups. For Libra. It is clarified with the moon. Could be dealing with a Pisces. But the moon symbolizes secrets or things that are not yet known. It can symbolize moodiness, depression, vivid dreams, deep emotions, intuition, but secrets. Could be dealing with a Pisces, but you can tell me that you're in the dark concerning something. You can tell me that you're using your intuition or there's a secret. Clarify the moon for Libra. Clarify the moon for Libra. Clarify the moon for Libra. It is clarified with the two of wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This is you being at a crossroads, needing to pick a path between two. Should I, shouldn't I? Will I, won't I? So Libra, you're at a crossroads, needing to decide, needing to pick a path here. So Libra, you can tell me that there is a secret coming out and you could be overindulging, trying to numb out and trying to figure out where to go from here. This secret that may be coming out may be concerning them having another other lover. Or this secret could be about you and you're just left here waiting to see what the end is going to be. I'm going to take a look at the Twin Flames Exposed for you and your partner, Libra. If you're interested in a private reading, you can reach me at herimmortalmajesty at gmail.com. And it says, I go back and forth in my mind whether or not I want this because I'm tired of hurting you. I go back and forth in my mind whether or not I want this because I'm tired of hurting you. I'm going to also take a look at the Hidden Truth Oracle for you and your partner, Libra. And it says, so many things remind me of you. So many things remind me of you. Libra, you need to know this right now for July the 19th through July the 20th, 2024. You guys, give me feedback. Subscribe, like, comment, and share. And follow me on TikTok, Twitter, and Instagram. And I'll see you guys next week. Peace.